going on guys? Taylor here with Diamond State Off-Road. Today we're going to be building a propane firebox. So, first off you're going to need an ammo can. You're going to need a propane burner. Comes with the hose, at least the one that I bought. You're going to need some rivets. You're going to need some stainless mesh. Cutters. Hole saw. Drill bits. Step bit. Spray paint, because I've already started taking the paint off of this one and a drill and a couple other various little things but we'll work through that in a minute also got some lava rocks but they're out of frame here so here we go we're gonna find center okay i cheated i had already had it pre-marked anyway so we have a circle there. This is in the center. So what I'm just going to do is draw an X and that'll find center of this hole for me. Just like that. Find the center. There. Snug fit. So then that's going to go through like that. Burner into here that's gonna thread into there and then tighten down which will hold our burner in place however we are not done there but obviously that's not tight I don't know if you can see in there but that's gonna work the burner has this plate that sits on there and this needs to be adjusted for airflow so now we need to make a couple of holes for airflow so, there you have it, just like that. Next, take this stainless mesh, and we're going to, looks like, cut it down a little bit. But it's going to go down in here and cover, that way we can put our lava rock down in there. So now I'm going to take 2x6 and start to bend so that will actually sit down in the box and then this is what will hold the lava rock so what i did here was i set the mesh up and marked there and there so i'm going to do hole saw like three times down in here but i want it lower than where my lava rocks are going to be so they don't fall out of the holes. Two and a half inches up. So five and a half is center. Two and a half and eight and a half. That'll sit like that. So now I'm going to measure for my upper ones that I'm going to rivet this end. Measure an inch and a half down and then do them center of my three holes. Four, seven. Alright, so I got a clamp. I'm going to get this centered up. So, looks like that. I 
So, I'm gonna do the other three and come back and see what we're doing next. Last one. So, got that done. Mesh is in there. That's done. Now we need to test it. <laughs> 